on the right you have a labeled diagram of a typical light microscope. I'm going to go through some of the more important pieces one by one. We'll start with the bit that you actually look down, which is the ocular lens, often referred to as the eyepiece. Uh, this actually has some built-in magnification. It's often 10 times magnification built in, and that's the bit that you're going to look down to be able to see the specimen. The specimen, either uh, on a slide or something else, sits on the stage, which is this part of the microscope. You've got stage clips, which you put the slide underneath to hold it in place. Um, and that can be moved up and down. The stage can be moved up and down by two dials on both sides of the microscope. So you have the coarse focus, sometimes known as the coarse adjustment, and then the fine focus. And by turning those, what you do is you actually move the stage up and down away from the light source when it's turned on. And that allows you to make the image clearer. It allows you to put the image into focus. Don't get that confused with the idea of resolution. Resolution is uh, the ability to distinguish between two parts. One way to think about it is if you're looking at a digital photograph and you keep zooming in, zooming in, zooming in, eventually it becomes blurry. The higher the resolution of the picture of the photograph, uh, the more you can zoom in without it becoming blurry. So you can almost think of it as the number of pixels. That's not the same as focus when we're talking about microscopes. Our coarse focus and our fine focus is about moving that stage up and down. Last but not least, you have your objectives. There are three, sometimes four objectives on the light microscopes that you will use in a, a typical secondary school science lab. Um, often one of them will be four times magnification, one of them will be 10 times magnification, one of them will be 40 times magnification. And you can turn those using the revolving piece that you see there um, so that you can change the magnification of a specimen as you're looking at it. So again, we've got the eyepiece, we've got the objectives in this photo, there's three of them. We've got the stage that the slide or the specimen sits on, and then we've got our Larger dial is the coarse focus adjustment and the smaller one is the fine focus adjustment.